Welcome back here to Live Now from Fox. Uh, some breaking news we're getting. This was the scene overhead earlier uh, outside of this school board meeting in Glendale, California. This is what we know. This protest held out there outside the meeting over students' rights to choose their own pronouns. Well, it took a chaotic turn tonight. Multiple groups gathered outside of the Glendale Unified School Board building as they protested over pronouns. At one point during the protests, punches were thrown and police in Glendale had to jump in to stop the violence there. Uh, the fights ended with at least one person in custody. Uh, the fights prompted police to ask the school board to go into recess inside as officers dealt with the chaos. The commotion and fights faded shortly after the fight uh, as crowds were ordered to disperse. Uh, though we're also being told that things got in uh, to a lot of commotion as well inside the building too. So uh, meanwhile, today in Los Angeles, uh, school board members there approved a resolution encouraging all schools to incorporate LGBTQ plus class concepts as part of the curriculum. We also spoke with Fox 11's Phil Schumann earlier today. Uh, he was in Temecula, where teachers gathered to protest the school district board's decision to exclude certain textbooks from the curriculum. Uh, the controversy there surrounds the debate over a social studies textbook proposed for the fourth grade curriculum that includes a portion, a passage, uh, on the biography of uh, legendary gay rights activist and icon Harvey Milk. So uh, a lot of these issues playing out not only in school boards across the country, but also specifically there in Southern California. Uh, so let's uh, take this here. We have a message from the Glendale Unified School District. And here's what it says. Uh, so the superintendent there uh, issuing these bullet points today, saying that elementary curriculum related to diversity, including LGBTQ plus issues, is focused on highlighting all different types of families. Elementary curriculum does not include specific information about LGBTQ plus or gender identity. And she goes on to say history and social science materials are aligned to the California history social science framework and California Senate Bill 48, known as the Fair Education Act. She goes on to say in Glendale Unified School District, health instruction related to teen development and sexual health education is taught in grades five, uh, that's development and maturation, seven uh, and nine, that's sex teachers are trusted to use professional judgment when deciding if a particular topic is suitable for study or discussion in accordance with the California Education Code and state law. But you can see, though, uh, it was quite chaotic earlier today outside of the building where the school board meets. You can see there a lot of news crews also in the parking lot as well. So we're gonna stay on top of this story. We've been covering this story really throughout the course of the day here, not only there in Glendale, but also in Temecula and Los Angeles as uh, the brewing debate over using the pronouns of your choice, gender identity, transgender issues, sexual identity, sexual orientation being taught in the classroom to very young students that is brewing ever so much there in Southern California, especially as we are, what, now six days into Pride Month.